Hi, my name is Rosbieta. I run a language school called Encio and I'm here to help you learn phrasal verbs. Because I guess you would like to master them finally. We're starting the series with phrasal verbs with kick. And the first one goes kick off. Kick off means to start, to begin. I'll give you three examples for the verb in three different sentences. The first one goes, let's kick our phrasal verb challenge off, shall we? Number two, with the lockdown over, the barbecue season has already kicked off. Yeah. I can smell some sausage from my neighbor's barbecue. And the third one goes, we are about to kick off our online summer English courses here at Encio. There's plenty to choose from. Why don't you join us? Kick around. Kick around has two meanings that I want to talk about here. The first one is analyze or discuss, and the other one is treat someone badly. So again, I'll give you three examples. And the first one goes, uh, a threat phrasal verb challenge. Yeah, I, I've been kicking this idea around for, for a few weeks and here I am making a video for you. And I'm so happy you're taking part in the challenge. Two, hey Sylvia, why don't you finally write the book you've been kicking around in your head for years? And the third one, Watch out, watch out here, it's for the other meaning. I'm fed up with the way my boss kicks me around. I'll quit the job. These are my examples. I'll put them in the comment uh, under the video, just to make your life easier. And I'm really looking forward to having yours there. Write comments and be sure uh, I'll go through them, I'll correct what's to be corrected, I'll praise what's good. Um, comment with your examples of the phrasal verb. Kick in is the third verb of our phrasal verb challenge and it means basically two things. To Contribute money, everyone a little bit, and then we have it, the sum that we need. And uh, the other is to start working, to, to start having an effect. Again, three examples for you. The first one for money contribution is um, if we all kick in, we'll be able to buy him a nice gift. And for the other meaning, to start having an effect, effect I'd say it takes about half an hour for the medication to kick in. Number three, the new standards or the new tax regulations aren't going to kick in until next year. So we still have some time for preparation. Kick out. Literally, it means throw out or expel someone, like from university, from school, um, make somebody leave, force somebody to leave. And the three examples, as always, you'll get are don't cheat in the exam or you'll get kicked out of college. Number two, if you start smoking in here, the manager will kick you out. The third one, the music band kicked the guitarist out after he had ruined the concert. Kick back! 
means simply to relax. And the three examples you're going to get from me are It's time to kick back. Just look what I'm doing. Kick back and lie on the sofa. So it's time to kick back after the long week. Number two, I can see you're overworked. Why don't you just kick back? You'll feel so much better. The third one goes, I wish I could just kick back and watch some movies on YouTube. Now it's time for you to start using the phrasal verb. In the comment section below, write some examples for me to read, for me to comment on, because using is what really makes the process of learning efficient. Don't be ashamed, don't be scared, just do it. Start writing your comments, start using the vocabulary and then, then you'll be able to kick back on the sofa. Bye!